Daria, and I'm in the aquarium in Jersey Shore. So I went around and I saw the different types of fishes and seals and everything. So I thought, let me just take a break now and just reminisce on what I saw and think about all the different things that came and went while I was sitting around. Like I saw this really gigantic fish. I also saw this striped fish that kind of looks like a leopard. And then I saw sharks. And it was really interesting because there wasn't just one type of shark. There were so many different types of sharks. I also made friends with a shark. Like one shark's name was Sharky. And there was this other guy that I called Bitey. And Sharky and Bitey were in the same tank at one point. Like, see, look, there's Sharky. And Sharky was slowly swimming across from where I was standing and showing off his nice fins and stuff. And then I decided, okay, I had enough of the sharks and I wanted to go see all the other things that were there. And the best thing I think I saw today were the seals. Because the seals were so cute and they looked like these little puppies that could swim in the water. And they all had such a great time. Except that, you know, I kept thinking, how come they can swim and they're much bigger than me and I can't swim yet. So I decided to show things to Pengi, but Pengi decided to take a nap behind me. And then I couldn't get Pengi from behind me and show him all the seals. Aren't the seals really cute? So you know what you should wonder sometimes? If the seals talk to each other, if they have best friends, if they go to seal school. And if they go to seal school, what do they learn? Like this guy over here, what does he learn? Does he learn how to swim backwards and forwards and up and down? Wow, look! They're going up and they're coming back down again. That's so amazing. I just wish I could do that too. Maybe when I start swim classes, that's what the teacher will teach me to do. Go up and down, up and down, and right and left, and swim around and around. I think that would be really cute. So Rockany Mousy's come to check on me, but I told her everything's A-OK. -okay. Look, there's a sea lion going. And they're swimming. It's so nice. Did, 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 did it come? Look, look, look. Upside down. So sweet. Oh, there, 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 there. There, there, there. There, there, there. there. She shows me everything, and now it's time for my milk break. So I need to have my milk break so I can grow, because milk has a lot of things that are important for you. And I feel like, just like I have milk, everyone should keep hydrated at all times. So if I have milk, you should have water or juice or whatever keeps you hydrated, because that's really important. So Ragini Masi put Pengi next to me so we can have a conversation about everything we saw. I asked Pengi if he wants some milk and Pengi came right up to my face and said, I don't want milk. Take it away from me. Okay, Pengi, I get the point. So they took you away from me instead and not my milk. Haha, <laughs> see how that works? Oh wait, Pengi's back. Okay, Pengi, so should we tell everybody all about our adventures today? What was your favorite part? I think Pengi's favorite part was the really cute mermaid he met at the store when I went to get a mermaid. Pengi, that's not a real thing. So, Pengi has a crush on the mermaid, and I'm really tired from today. So, while I have my milk, I was watching the seal in the corner, and it's really funny because all the other seals were just swimming around him, and he didn't want to move. I think he's as tired as I am. He's probably also contemplating what all he saw today. Like the amount of people that came up to the window. He's probably thinking about me. He's probably saying, Oh yeah, I remember that girl in the pink shirt while she was having her milk looking at me. What a great day today was. It was such an amazing day. And there were so many different kids that came up and said hi. I wonder what the seals think about all day when they're sitting in that glass window thing. And you know... The really amazing thing other than the seals was this ship that was right in the middle. It looked like it was going to sail off into the sunset. And I wanted to be a part of that ship. I wanted to go on that ship, but mommy said I have to sit in my stroller. So I kept playing peekaboo with the ship and saying, Hey, Mr. Ship, can I climb onto you? And mommy said, Listen, you need to turn and face forward so you and Pengi can play. And I told Pengi, 
Pengy, do you want to go on the ship and play treasure, treasure? And Pengy agreed it was a great idea. So what do you guys think about that? Do you ever think about finding treasure on a ship? I watched it on this one cartoon once, and I feel like it was a great idea, so I brought it up. And other than that, in aquariums, there are also other things you can do. Did you know that an aquarium also has lots of different pictures that inform you about beetles and things, and bugs, and grasshoppers, and plants and stuff? I didn't know that, but Mommy read some of it to me, and it seemed quite interesting. So now it's almost time for me to change my diaper, and Mommy said that it's also important to keep clean at all times, because you shouldn't let yourself get dirty. Whether it's your hands, or your mouth, or your diaper, or your feet. You know, these are all important things to remember. Even if you're in an aquarium, doesn't mean you have to stay dirty. Subscribe, okay?